Below the water line. Oh, his ammo rack turned a little orange there. A little bit lower, maybe. Into the water. Oh, it fucking works! Look at Yo, guys, what's up, Fly here? Welcome back to the channel. Today's video, we are checking out the testing of new ships in War Thunder, AKA the Destroyers. I'm finally on the server. I don't know if you guys had problems getting on the servers, but I did, it took me about an hour and a half to get on. So thank thankfully we're able to test this out today. So before we get started, there's some things we need to talk about so we can keep an eye out for, because a lot of things have changed uh, in the meta or just how the game mechanics work in War Thunder, Naval Forces or Fleet, whatever you, or Navy, whatever you guys want to call it. First is, damage model so remember uh last testing we you kind of had to play whack-a-mole you had to get every last crew member to kill the ship well it's not like that anymore the ships are split up into compartments if you destroy that compartment all the crew in that compartment is dead so it's much easier to kill boats and ships and that makes it a lot easier to kill bigger ships because there's so many crew members the next is survivability so now you'll have to control the fire extinguisher and flooding. Also from the dev blog, I quote, from now on player will control only the main guns by default. Secondary and AA guns are controlled by AI and can fire at will. The player may choose which type of targets these guns will fire at. Also, this is from the dev blog and I quote, from now on player will control only the main guns by default. Secondary and anti-air guns are controlled by the AI and can fire at will. The player may choose which type of targets these guns will fire at or turn off automatic fire completely. By default, air targets are chosen for automatic fire, end quote. So what that tells me is that we're still able to control secondaries and anti-air. They're just handled uh, by the game or by the AI for us until we take control of them. We'll have to test that out. And the last thing, but not least, we have torpedo leads now, kind of like World of Warships. So uh, torpedoing just got a lot easier. I hope that maybe this should be for arcade. In realistic battle, those would be turned off. So without further ado, we're going to try out the tribal class destroyer first. Here we go, guys. Welcome to the map. This is Ice Fields. Apparently, this is the massive map that we played uh, in that one closed beta test with the uh, bigger patrol boats. But here's a tribal class. 3.0! Holy cow, so what can we expect with 8.3 or 8.0 in them? Or 9.0 or 15? I don't care. Whatever. So we have three turrets with a 120 millimeter gun, and those are times two. So we have six guns in total. There's two guns housed in a turret. We also have 202 millimeters. We have four 40 millimeters, uh, two 20s, and two... Is that... We have eight 50 cals, I believe. Hopefully that's right. Wow. I've never... Oh my gosh. We don't have APHE. But that doesn't really matter because ships don't have that much armor, especially not destroyers. The HE should be perfect, but just continues on. God darn, the British is a solid shot. All right, let's spawn in. Oh my gosh, fuck yeah, full power. Look how cool this looks. Sorry about that. So we have, there's our back gun, 100, 220, 220 millimeter guns in the back, and then we have four in the front. Where's the other one? We should have one more somewhere. Okay, those just look a little different, but they're the same gun. Okay, got it. Just different color schemes. I was about to freak out. So, the first gun is gray, the second gun is white, and the third main gun in the back is white as well. So, uh, from the dev blog, we're able to assign AIs to control our secondaries and our... I don't know about primaries. Our secondaries and anti-air. But if we want to control them, how do we do that? So, wow. What are you shooting at? What the? So to get the AIs to start shooting, I think all I do is just select and maybe that will do it. I don't know, that's a pretty far shot. I don't think they're going to be engaging. But if we wanted to do it, we have one for primaries, two for secondaries. So this gun in the back, the 202 millimeters are our secondaries. And then three should be our anti-air. They're coming alive right now. 
fuck yeah. And then we go back to primaries. Okay, so we have two enemy destroyers in front. One's getting kind of close to our right. It's a torpedo boat. Way too in front. This guy is closer than I think. We're going to turn to the left. Oh, God. Someone nailed him. Someone nailed him real good. We have two tribal class destroyers in Fort... Wait, actually, no. We have the Russian one right here. Dude, that one looks like the uh, Brimyoshki. I think. Okay, let's get some shots on target here. We got a destroyer right here. On the way. Complete, complete miss. We got to realize that we're moving to the left, so we got to fire to the right. There we go. Right in the... Good hit. Much better. Much better hit. Wow. Beautiful. That was sick. That was cool. That was really fun. That was much more fun than going... So we got one more destroyer over here. And so I believe we're going 60 kilometers an hour. Full flank, as you can see on the left side of the screen. Now, I think the whole objective this game is to kill the cargo ships. Ooh, and we also have torpedoes. How do I do torpedo? Oh, okay. Well, bye-bye. Those just follow my mouse wherever it goes. Let's go to controls and see how we find it. Oh, torpedo aiming. Q. Got it. Cool. So you can toggle it if you want to or if you don't want to. So I'm going to turn in a little bit. These guys are going off the map, but they are staying in formation. And oh my gosh, this guy is... He just sunk. Oh man, that 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 is... Oh man, that looks great. It's sad, but... Oh shit. <laughs> <laughs> Quality. That's real nice. Okay, so we got a Wellington up. We're going to get our... We're going to press three for our secondaries. Or excuse me, our anti-air. What are you shooting at, dude? Oh, he's shooting at the, the Furies up there. Okay, I believe we have the... An yep, anti-air selected. Here comes the Welly Jelly. Don't go for me. I think he is. Open it up. Got a hit. Fire the Ah, oh, they're not firing. Let's go back to one and press X on them so our, our AIs do it. Yeah, look at them. They're, they're tracking it by themselves. Now, let's clean up these cargo ships because this is the objective of this game. Going for a spout first, I guess. We only have two guns on target. Critical hit. Nice. On the way. Okay, we're gonna get our back gun on target. And we could send a torpedo at these guys as well. Gunner. Okay, now let's just shoot for the back portion because the uh, front portion is black. Or the front two portions are black now. Yeah, 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 yeah. We've already killed that over and over again. This is, okay, now this is aimed more for the rear. A little bit short. That looks a lot better. Okay, it's orange now. Ooh, shit. We just got nailed. Okay, we're going to press B to stop flooding and F to repair whatever we just got hit with. I believe it was this destroyer from far range. Though I can't see him because there's poles in front of me. Open it up. Just missed me right there. That destroyer is behind the iceberg. Let's go again for this cargo ship. Swing and a miss. I'm trying to go for that very back portion. There we go. Tango down. Who's this? Oh, shit. Guns to left. Guns to port. Guns to port. <laughs> Torpedoes, maybe. Big hit. Enemy ship on fire. Dropping torpedoes. Oh, 
Firing. Right for his bridge. Torpedoes are on good line. Oh, we just took, we just took a big hit right there. We're gonna try to disengage. Enemy aircraft down. Oh, we could have Wellington. Where are our torpedoes at? I can't see him in the water. I think I see a trail. Okay, he's dead. Let's put that fire out. Okay, the cargo ships are opening up on us now. Fire down. B to repair the hole. Okay, the back section is now damaged. The back section is now damaged again. Good. Put it out. Okay, we got a destroyer in front of us. We got a huge repair time now. Fire doused. Come on. We missed that shot. Good hit. Right in the front. Press B. Get that gun. Get that gun. Good hit. I don't think, I don't think we're going to make this. Team. Oh no, I got a buddy, but he's not focusing this guy, which is okay. He's focusing the guy to the right. We only have one active gun. No penetration right there. No penetration. Okay. Ooh. Shit. We got to really check this armor value out. Unfortunately, we can't do it in uh, the, uh, the hangar. What happened there is that we shot probably two times, no penetration. Maybe it was by, you know, the bridge where there was more armor. And uh, now we know. So next time we will definitely use an AP for him. See, there, there's going to be some skill involved with this type of ranging. Or fire distance. That wasn't that bad. Our back gun does not have the angle. We got an enemy plane up coming close. It's a Nimrod. We got two Welly Jellies up too. Those should be good. Those should be great, actually. Come on, hit him. Yes! Nice! On the way again. Okay, anti air, get ready for that Wellington. Good hit again. Now, this game isn't big at all, as you can see. So if it seems kind of docile, it's just because there's not that many players in here. He's coming in for us. We got two coming in for us. Got two hits on him. He's down. Bombs out. No bombs yet. Whoa! Fuck me! Press X on that guy. We gotta focus on the uh, task at hand. Destroyer close. That was awesome. But I think as I play more, these controls will get a little less uh, clunky. A little less clunky. Because they, they feel really clunky right now, but that's just because of nupidity. With playing this for... Wow, that was weird. A little more to the left. Much more to the left. There's a good salvo right there. Beautiful. Good hit. Bridge. He hit me good as well. He's got AP going. He's on AP now. I wonder if we should switch. Oh shit. Secondary's on him. Oh, 
Oh shit, we're going to take a torpedo though, I'm pretty sure. We got to turn into these right now. I can see it in the water. There it is. Turn, baby, turn. Good. We got his fucking smokestack. He just dropped torpedoes as well. I can see them. Okay, 28 seconds. Good, good, good. Okay, I wonder if these torpedoes have lo loaded yet, or we only have two left, Enemy it seems. Torpedo. Here we go for the torpedo drop. One, two. Almost done repairing. I'm gonna load HE too, or AP. Come on, torpedoes, get them! Yes, they're looking good! Where do they go? Oh, those did fucking nothing right there. Thank you, beast. Good shit. That guy is quality right now. I don't know where our torpedoes went. I don't know who he was going for right there. But we're going to have a shot chance here. Oh, he's moving a little too quick for those. I might want to wait for my teammate to get here a little bit closer. We're going to try to disengage to the left. Fire on board. Huh, the AP shells just caused fire. Oh, okay, let's see if we can have a kill cam here. What was he shooting us with? It looked like it was AP. Maybe AP is the way to go. So before I leave today, I want to try to ammo rack this destroyer. We're going to try with AP first and then switch to HE if that doesn't work. As you can see, below the waterline-ish is the uh, the ammo rack. So we're going to need AP to go through the water, but maybe if that doesn't work, we can splash damage or with the HE. We should be out in the open right about now. Yeah, 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 yeah. Right below the waterline. Where'd he go? I know this guy's been here, but there should be one destroyer even closer. Oh, he's waiting for me. He is. Below the water line. Oh, his ammo rack turned a little orange there. A little bit lower, maybe. Into the water. Oh, it fucking! Ammunition storage! That's awesome! That is so fucking great! Oh man, I, couldn't, I can't tell you how big a relief that is. Because the biggest problem with the ships, or the boats in the prior testing, is uh, just whack-a-mole the whole entire time. And now it's even easier to kill enemy sh uh, ships or boats like that. Oh man, fan flipping tastic. Good. That should be game. Tickets are going down. Fun first impressions. Hope you guys have enjoyed today's video. <laughs> uh, tomorrow, I should be playing the Russian destroyer. Guys, have a good rest of the day. Until next time, peace out.